back to my channel. So I have my lovely model today. Her name is Tokwe. <laughs> Say hi. Yes. Yeah. Today we're going to be doing Nigerian makeup and gele, and uh, you guys already know when we do when we in Nigeria we always go glamorous, you know, for our traditional wedding. So I'm going to be doing a Nigerian um, makeup and gele kind of uh, look today. But guys, there's something new today. We're not going to be using Mac Cosmetics today. We're going to be going to be using. Karen Cosmetics, okay? Karen Cosmetics is spelled C A R R O N. So, Karen Cosmetics for today makeup tutorial, okay? So, we're gonna see. This is actually my first time using Karen Cosmetics. Karen herself did my makeup for today as well. She was here and she did my makeup. So, this is just a little bit of stuff that you guys know. This is not how I do my makeup. Like, I go all out. Well, this is just a soft glam. She did like a little bit of soft glam for me. Okay, so mm -hmm. I'm gonna like tell you a little bit about Karen Cosmetics. Okay, so Karen Cosmetics, yeah, is a cruelty free natural makeup brand. Okay, they are available online. I'm gonna put a link to their website in the description box under this video so you guys do check them out and support them. Okay. They are all natural. Is that the brand uh, uses natural ingredients, and uh, the more or less uh, she uses um, shea butters in most of the products. So guys, do check them out. So we're gonna be trying Karen Cosmetics today, and uh, you guys are gonna see how the brand is. I hope you guys will like it. So we're gonna get started. <laughs> I'll be cleaning the brows um, and shaping the brows. Brows magic. <laughs> the this. I've not. I've not even. I've not even finished, guys. So let's do the top now. So yeah. Look at that guys, amazing, amazing. That brows is looking glamorous. <laughs> wow, look at before and after there. <laughs> I'm gonna be priming the face with the ponds. Yeah, ponds, yeah. So this is all I've got. Apply that on the face as a primer. So it's gonna help the face to mattify the face. Okay, primer is done. <laughs> Her shade in Karen Cosmetics is uh, the D6. I'm using the D6 cream foundation for our foundation. So I'm using that all over the face. So I'm using the Beauty Blender to apply the foundation. This foundation is, um, is uh, made of uh, shea butter. So you have to warm it up before you apply them. So warm it up. To make it a little bit creamy okay so you warm it up like so to make it a little bit creamy because it's a uh, shea butter so you have to warm it up so that's what i'm doing now okay so now i'm going to use the beauty blender to apply it it's actually nice you know yeah it's covering really well yeah. it's covering really well guys i love the coverage First impression guys, the coverage. I love the coverage. It's covering really, really well. Mm -hmm. It's creamy. Yeah. Nice and feels and clean. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Wow. Because when she uses on me, I was like, mm. <laughs> Apparently she didn't apply a lot. Too then. much. Wow. I'm loving it guys. It's actually really great. <laughs> amazing first impression like i cannot even believe it's actually doing amazing job it's covering really well because she even have a dry skin i think you have a dry skin yeah. isn't it for dry skin it's actually really good because it's sitting really well on her skin wow it's giving that good coverage no amazing look at that flawless <laughs> Wow. So 
guys look at that foundation is done <laughs> foundation is done guys yep <laughs> So guys, foundation is done and I'm going to go ahead and highlight the face and, uh, you know, to contour the face, I'm going to do a little bit of lighter color for the highlighter. Okay. You're not used to brands. No, no if you're not used to the brands, if it's mad, I know which one yes. I will use. So, highlighting the face. So let me try. Let me try that side. So guys, uh, because I don't know her highlight color, that is why I'm tr I've tried this on the other side. So her highlight color should be M4. The forehead as well. Yeah. <laughs> so here. I like the fact that this is a yellow base as well. So it's giving that yellow color, which is good. Color is not bad. It's not ashy as well, which is good. Because a lot of the time, it's a, when you highlight on darker skin tone, you can be, you can, you can look ashy. Yeah. So this is actually great. That it's looking. That's a yellow undertone. So guys, again, I'm using current cosmetics to set under the eyes where I did highlight it. Okay. So this is the shade M1. Okay. Yeah. So face is already contoured and set, you guys. So I've set the face to the loose powder. So now I'm gonna do the brows. So, so I'm gonna do the brows. Okay. Karen has her own brow pomade. That's what she used on me today. So she did my makeup. Okay, guys. Did my makeup. So she have a brow pomade and a brow she has a brow powder and then this is how it looks like okay so i'm gonna try using that i normally use pencil you guys so i'm gonna try using the powder this time and see how it goes okay i'm gonna start with the lighter shade and the, it comes with a brush let's see so this is how it should look okay but i think i'm gonna go over with with my Rimmel, yeah, to make it come out. It actually has two colors, the light and the dark. So let me try with the darker one on top to build it up. You guys, I'm going over with my pencil, which is the Rimmel Black Brown. So I'm going to go over the brows and fill it in again. Okay. Guys, to sculpt the brows, I'll use my MAC concealer because I like the fact that this is much stronger and thicker. So for sculpting the sculpting the brows, prefer to use this one from MAC is NC45. So I'm gonna use that to sculpt the brows. When it comes to brow sculpting, I like my concealer to be very, very very thick so that's what we're doing so i'm gonna do this one first set the concealer I will use the current cosmetics, uh, the powder I used to set the eye. Just gonna use that to set there, so it's not gonna be like all oh, watery. Yeah, use that here. So for the crease color, I'm using current cosmetics again, and this is uh, a blush, and uh, is in the color four. By using that as a shadow, so I'll be placing that here, just to warm the crease
on top of that i'll be using this one it's a purplish blush again on top here in the socket they're going to come back to the eye with the color that i'm using to set the face i'm going to use that to finish the blending so that's what i always do but for now i'll proceed to the base Okay, so I'm using Max of Okra as the base for my shadows. So I'm using doing a bluish shadow. Okay, let's see the other side. Look at this thing. Could you open a little too? There with demi with speed to you guys for the lashes. Yup. <laughs> there you are. So you guys, when I do the the lashes, I like to seal the band. So I'm gonna use a gel liner again and go over the band. Guys, no, I didn't say the other side. I didn't highlight like the other side. The other side of it, like here. So I'm gonna set that now here. So I'm using the D2 because I did not highlight these areas. Set them, warm it up. So you dust it off with a mineral light skin finish. So this one I'm using MAC mineralized skin finish. So I'm using that to dust off the same powder that I use, the same powder from Caron Cosmetics. So cheek contour again. So just guys i'm using deep cherry from caron cosmetics okay so yeah deep cherry so i'm using that then on top of that let me use this one which is a blush number three terracotta a little bit on the deep cherry okay just to warm it up okay look at that pretty So on top of that, I'll be using the terracotta, the orangey one. These are my two favorite ones, actually. I love these two colors. Any orange is actually beautiful on darker skin tone. So, yeah. Nice. The blushes are nice. Yeah. Blushes are nice, guys. <laughs> blushes are nice. Really lovely. Love these two colors that I picked. Wow. Ooh, look at that. <laughs> so let's do the 
it's actually good for you to use different brands because I think I've been stuck with Mac for yeah. days. So this is actually fun. You guys should be happy. You should be grateful because you guys. You <laughs> only use Mac cosmetics. Yes. Correct. Look now. I'm not using. Okay, let's try this highlighter. Okay, let's try this highlighter from Karen. Okay, let's see. Let's open it. Ooh. Okay, so let's try it and see if it's gonna pop our face. <laughs> let's see. Yeah, let's see. So let's see. Ooh, it's lovely. Wow, isn't it? Yeah. Wow. So I'm just gonna place it here, then I'll blend it out and wow. I love it. If it's if there's one thing you guys should get from Karen, get this highlighter. It's bay. Guys, <laughs> let's see. Wow. I'm gonna set the face so it's it won't look powdery. Okay, so I'm gonna spray the face with Max Face Floss to take off this powdery effect. So yeah, fix floss. No, don't close too tight. Just close softly. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, so that's it. So <laughs> I love that lipstick actually. Yeah. It's just not that bright, yeah. which is good. So we're gonna do the gala, you guys. I'm gonna just. Do the gale quickly. Okay. So you guys, I think this is the gale. Because you have braids on guys, you can't go any higher than this, but we tried. Oops, we're gonna clean up here now. <laughs> I think this is what we're talking to. Let me see if I see they are doing makeup. So Looks like good. Ooh. 